that's happening at Utopia Farms today. Arnie wanted to shear their wool off before they went in breeding groups. Definitely not perfect, but he's looking good. So let's get started. Today was supposed to be a nice day and Arnie was going to take a ne the next batch of hay down. But as always, it's raining. So today we're going to be shearing those dorsets off and get them into breeding groups. We're just feeding the ewe lamb group. Okay, looks really nice. We opened the gate to let them out, but it is a rain day. This was supposed to be a sunny week, but obviously not. Hi, Mom. These guys are still free to go out if they want to, and maybe, hopefully, it'll clear up by this afternoon. It does give us a chance to get caught up on our sheep stuff, but uh, being behind on the hay is never good. We are at the next bar. Alexander's waiting. These guys are patiently waiting. Oh my goodness, you boys are lovely. I'm thinking I'm not going to call him Moron, because now he's such a sweetheart. I am going to call him Marcus. Hi, Marcus. That's a much more regal name for you. And now we're just working in the U barn. These are all the U's that are going to go in the second breeding group on this side. Um, probably in a few weeks. So this is the skinny girls. Same thing with them. We're going to monitor their condition and when they're ready, we'll put them into a breeding group too. But until then, they're just getting, um, they're indoors because they've all been dewormed and they're going to get uh, good hay. Arnie's just forking out the old stuff now. And he'll be putting a nice fresh bale in for these ones. But this whole barn's been dewormed. And, not all, and these guys, we just didn't have enough room for another breeding group. Everyone in this side is in perfect condition. So they'll be first to get a ram. We might even put two rams in here. We haven't decided who, who we're going to use on this group yet. It's really raining now on our nice sunny hay day. Arnie's rolling out a bale for these guys. And that's morning feedings done. And like I say this afternoon, I think uh, we're going to catch those Dorset rams and see if we can peel the wool off them and get them into breeding groups. So this core of the bale, Arnie took it out of the feeder and he's going to pick it up and bring it over to our big rams. They can't eat an entire wet bale in a quick enough time, so what he's been doing is putting the little cores in each day so that they can eat fresh hay. This is the size dorsets they're supposed to be. They're not supposed to be those horses that you ride. So finally we got some rams that are the right size. Arnie wanted to shear their wool off before they went in breeding groups. We're doing... I don't know if we're doing the smaller one or the bigger one. They're so close in size.
to do a test? Yep, go ahead and do a test. Here you go. Well, let me know I'm going close now. Yep. Once you pat him, he'll be fine. He just doesn't know you're coming. See that his feet be doing. Okay, this is the first guy done. Now we're going to try work on the other one, but we're going to do him in the main barn where we have more room.
Sure, change them up when he gets here. There's the other one. At least the bulk of his wool's off. Definitely not perfect, but he's looking good. So we're gonna bring him into his breeding group and then we're probably gonna put a little wall so that the two rams don't fight. Hi, you look very nice. He's not in the mood for that. You want me to get his belly a bit? Or I think he's good enough. I can see if I can get him. But if he doesn't like it, we'll leave. All the friendlies seem to have gotten into this group. Here we have Thelma. And we have Diva here. And we have Looney. Paul Lips is in here too. We decided to breed her. Well, thanks for taking the time to watch us amateurs working at trying to shear sheep. I think it didn't turn out too bad. But tomorrow you'll have to join us again because those two dapper boys are going to be put into their breeding groups. So we'll have to see what they use think of those guys. Anyway, until then, bye for now.
This is our little room at night.